Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. Today I am bringing you some Sims 4 news. Now, if you didn't know, um, for some context, a couple of weeks ago I think, either last month or earlier this month, there was a quote-unquote leak for a Sims expansion called Horse Ranch. And today they revealed the roadmap from June to September called Take the Reins. It says a Rootin' Tootin' expansion pack, two bold kits, a Behind the Sims Summit stream, and more. Now, I don't have Instagram on my computer, so I can't show you exactly uh, what it looked like. But if you've seen it, um, it looks very Western themed, and by Western I mean Wild West. And as you can see right now, we are on the Sims Community info site, and it says the Sims 4 Horse Ranch first features and screenshots. The Sims 4 Horse Ranch has been Horse Ranch has been leaked entirely. See what we know about the pack. After several reports about the Sims 4 Horse Ranch and leaks online, we have an official leak, this time coming from Steam. The official Steam leak has revealed all screenshots, screenshots, box art, and features for the upcoming Sims 4 expansion, Horse Ranch. Find out what's coming in the pack, and then this is what the box art looks like. Uh, looks very interesting. Um, I'm super excited for this, so if, if I get it, if horses and Wild West stuff isn't your thing, I completely understand, but as someone who plays a lot of Sims and who, if you remember my D&D &D Sims thing that I was doing, I was trying to do a Western theme for my Bard generation, didn't really come out because all I had to work with was Strangerville. This would have been perfect. <laughs> okay, this would have been so perfect for him. But I digress. Uh, table of contents about the Sims 4 Horse Ranch. Sims 4 Horse Ranch key features and screens. Rockin' Rancher digital content. And when is the Horse Ranch releasing? Now there is going to be a trailer coming out tomorrow that I might... Re not tomorrow, but Thursday that I might record my reaction to. I'm not entirely sure yet. Um, but I do intend to upload this video tonight. Um, and by tonight, I mean like on the 20th. I'll upload it so it goes up Wednesday. Um, so I'll have a plethora of videos this week, pretty much. Every, every day is going to have a new video because of this. The 14th expansion pack in the Sims 4 series is retailed at $40, of course, or $39.99 USD, or a price similar to your local currency. It features a new world, horses, customizable ranches, sheep, and other ranch animals, plus more. Check out what's included in the pack with an official description and key features. Oh, excuse me. Okay. Work hard and play hard with animal friends and your own stretch of land in the Sims 4 Horse Ranch expansion pack. Raise, train, and form special bonds with majestic horses that are customizable members of your family. You can also care for mini sheep and mini goats or make a living selling homemade nectar. Carve out your own unique life on the ranch. Purchase... Purchase through August 31st to get bonus items for your hardworking Sims to enjoy. So, I didn't say anything about this because I didn't do a video on the Horse Ranch leak. Personally, I thought that if, that they should have released it as a game pack instead because I wasn't entirely sure how horses were going to fill out an expansion pack. But seeing all the stuff that they're adding to it, I think it's going to be a pretty good expansion pack. And I'm definitely going to get it. And I'll, I'll try to get it when it comes out. But, you know, money is kind of tight lately. So I don't know if I'm actually going to be able to get it. But when I get it, I'm doing a series on it. You can bet I will be doing a sim series on Horse Ranch. No questions, no if, ands, or buts. It is happening. <laughs> anyway, Sims 4 Horse Ranch key features. Rockin' Rancher digital content. Treat your Sims to relaxation after a hard day's work with a resonator guitar, wagon wheel art, and a rustic rocking chair available when you order through August 31st. 
Now, for this, a lot of the expansion packs lately have had this, where they'll add, like, three pieces that you can get if you buy it before a certain date, this one being August 31st. And I know a lot of people don't like that, but look at it as a business, not as someone who has to buy the game. They're doing this because they need to give people um, an incentive to buy it when it comes out instead of waiting for a sale. At least that's how I see it, you know? And I really don't care. I like having new items, especially a new guitar, because we know we need one, okay? <laughs> Make a life. Because uh, we don't... Uh, you know what? Let's just keep on focus. I don't want to get off topic. I don't want this video to be 30 minutes long. Get up early in the morning, look out at the big open countryside, and know that all your work is worth it. Spend days keeping your animals happy and clean, harvesting prairie grass to feed them, collecting horse manure. That's not how you say that word, but it's okay. To fertilize your plants and making your own nectar to sell. Do it all on a ranch you design, whether that means a traditional cabin or a big red barn. Bond with animals, fill your ranch with animal friends, and carve out a life together. Your horses, including adorable foals, are part of your household and have lots of special interactions with both sims and other horses. You can also care for many goats and many sheep and invite neighbors to come see how cute they are. I'm so excited for the animals. Like, yes, I think horses should have come with cats and dogs. It should have been just been pets. But... I'm glad they took their time to work on horses because I'm sure horses ha like, have taken them a while to actually work and make sure that they're not super buggy, stuff like that, is what I'm thinking. That's why it's taken so long, because you have to be able to ride your horses and have to- I'm assuming you're going to be able to ride them around town, so they have to go through and make sure that that's not glitchy and all that. But anyway, I digress. Uh... <laughs> Join a thriving community. Live on a ranch. Living on a ranch has its moments of peace and solitude, but there's also a lively social scene. Your sims can go into town to meet friends at the bar, blow off steam at the dance hall, or train at the equestrian park. They can also host events like cookouts and dances on their own property and hire a ranch hand to help when work builds up. Ooh. Raise horses. Horses are part of the family. Customize hoofed friends and create a sim or get new horses by rescuing or purchasing them. Foals can also be born on your ranch. Sims can learn the riding skill and horses can train in the agility and jumping skills. S skilled horses and riders can even win awards at the equestrian center. Wait, wait, wait. So horses can get skills. Does that mean we're going to be able to control the horses? Because we can't control cats and dogs, which... I understand, kind of, they're kind of like NPCs in your house. I know in Sims 3 you could control them, and a lot of people were upset that you couldn't control them in Sims 4. Frankly, that doesn't bother me too much, but if we're able to control the horses, that's going to be so cool. It's going to be just amazing. I can't I can't wait for this pack. Can y'all tell I can't wait for this pack? Here are, some, here are all the official Sims 4 Ranch screenshots that have been leaked over on Steam. All right. I can't click on them for some reason. I can't make them bigger, so we're just going to look at them like this. Uh, here, I'll just zoom in so we can look. Oh. Okay, there we go. So as you can see, here's what I'm assuming is a nectar-making station. It kind of looks like he's making wine. Um, my boyfriend actually said he's making moonshine, because, you know, it's kind of based on the Wild West. Anyway. Here are the little baby mini sheeps and mini goats. God, I can't wait. Also, these clothes look amazing. Like, this hair back here looks really cool. The horses look amazing. I love the kids. Like, little jacket there. And this, this mini cowboy baby co toddler suit is just, oh, chef's kiss. I hope we get little, like, cowboy hats. Because it looks like this is, like, a new cowboy hat. Because we have a couple in the game. This one looks new. And I don't even get me started on the horses. They look so good. And then, like, the wood textures on, like, the ranch barn here and everything. God, it's so good. And here's this one. This one must be, like, at the bar where you can get your dance. This looks like it's going to be a new style of dancing. 
Like, you know how Selva Dorada has a certain style of dancing? This one looks like it's going to be a new style for this world or for this pack. We got a new standing piano, which looks, again, chef's kiss. Uh, we just got a new standing piano with, um, oh, I can't remember the name of the pack now. Growing Together. And we just need more of them. Um, I'm loving these hairs. Like, this, these hairs just look so good. This one, I think, might be new. I'm not entirely sure. Cowboy boots, of course. I mean, do I need to say anything else? Y'all know how I am about cowboy boots. Uh, again, the cowboy hat. It looks like we might have some new birthmarks, or unless those are the ones that have come with, like, the, um... That came with the base game update a couple months ago. I'm loving these clothes. Like, I know the cow print isn't for everybody, but I it's I can't get over it. It looks so good. I love this braid. I love the decor in the back. Oh, I, 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 I'm in love. I'm in love. And here's this little guy. I actually looked at this before I did the video, but I took a screenshot of this and sent it to my friends. And one of my friends said there wasn't a thought in this little guy's head. And it really looks like it, like no brain cells in there. He's just having the time of his life. I'm also, this looks like it might be like the place where your horse can go to sleep, maybe. And there's a little goat in the back interacting with that horse. That's cute. I'm loving it. Oh my god, I can't. I can't. This horse looks so pretty. I'm loving the decor, the clutter items. That window looks like really cool. I love how there's like little horse. I'm guessing you can like win prizes. Th this looks really nice. I'm, again, I don't know if this has been mentioned before, but I'm really hoping we get clutter items that are like just pillows that you can like, that can clip onto benches and stuff. That would be really cool. And I think that would be a really nice um, addition. Here's what I'm guessing is the equestrian park. Uh, you can see some, the most of the world in the back. That looks like it might be the bar. Of course, horses galore. This looks like a little, like a house maybe. It looks really good. <laughs> the Sims 4 Rockin' Rancher digital content. This pack follows suit of previous expansion pack releases when it comes to digital content. Players who pre-order the Sims, the Sims 4 Horse Ranch by the end of August will get Rockin' Rancher digital content entirely free. So just this stuff. Um, this guitar looks really nice. I, uh, I also, I am a sucker for new rocking chairs. We have currently two rocking chairs in the game. One from Nifty Knitting and one from give me a second, growing together, which I love them. Don't get me wrong. They're great rocking chairs, but these, these just have a sense. These, these just look homey. You know what I mean? Uh, when is the Sims 4 horse range releasing? It's releasing July 22nd across all consoles. So that's about a month away. Um, about a month away from when the trailer uh, releases, which they've been doing that for a while now, um, releasing the trailer like a month before it actually comes out. Uh, they did that for Growing Together. Actually, I think for Growing Together it was a little over a month. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope you are as excited as I am about the horse ranch. I'll try to keep you guys updated on everything that's coming with it, if I get any new news. If I get what the world's called, I'll, it'll be there. Um, if you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, leave a comment. Um, as always, my Discord link will be in the, uh, the pinned comments below if you'd like to join my Discord. Um, and I will see you all in the next video. Thank you so much and goodbye.